everyone, and welcome to the Joy of Editing with Dave Kelly. Uh, thank you so much for joining me today. On today's episode, we're looking at Topaz Studio 2. Today, we're looking at the dehaze filter. I thought today I would let you guys see my face, that yes, there is a real person here editing these images, and this is he, Dave Kelly. So here I am. I'm going to start out by putting my glasses on so I can see what I'm doing. Without them, I have a hard time seeing, so... Thank God for glasses. So now I'm going to start to set it. Now, this particular image was shot in Ohio, and I believe it was a place called Cuyahoga Falls. There was a ton of waterfalls here. Very treacherous getting through the woods here. This was a rainy day. This was a day I picked up a tick in the woods. First tick in my life. Thank God I didn't get Lyme's disease, but wow, that was wild. So a memorable trip due to the tick actually. And the waterfalls were amazing too, so that was cool, makes it memorable. Uh, beautiful scene here, this was early spring, greens were just starting to pop out on the trees, leaves and things like that. But this particular, particular day was very rainy and hazy and I think I had a water drop in my lens, you can see right here, I think that was a drop of water on my lens. Had my tripod out, I was doing some long exposures here. Um, I like this shot, but the haze is killing it. So let's see what the dehaze filter will do. So let's come up here to add filter. We're in Topaz Studio. So give that a click and let us go down to dehaze right here. Oh, and by the way, I want to point out, you notice here, every all these filters are in groups. This is the essentials group right here. This is the creative group and the stylistic group. And these names represent what's in here. These would be stylistic type images or filters and creative filters and essential filters for the basic adjustments. And dehaze happens to be one of those basic essential filters. So let's give it a click. So we're going to click it. And as with all topaz filters we have an opacity adjustment we have blend modes we have presets we've went all went all over that before so let's come right here to the two sliders this is a very simple uh filter and it's very effective as well so we want to get rid of the haze in this picture so we're going to take the string slider and just start to move it to the right as we do you notice that haze starts to go away now there's a little bit of a problem that happens when you keep moving it to the right and that is the image starts to tend to go a little bit blue and all dehaze all dehaze filters in photoshop and different pieces of software they will give you different color shifts when you're adjusting them to the extremes so we got to be careful here so we're going to come here move the strength the whole way to the right and we see that ugly blue so let's just back it off just till it disappears and maybe somewhere right around there now let's try something here. Let's come up to the blend modes and let's change the blend mode to luminosity. And as we do, and I think we've got rid of that bluish uh, shift that we were getting there. Let me move the strength side of the whole way to the right. Yeah, see that? That gets rid of most of that color shift there. We don't really see it. So that's a nice little tip there, guys. Move that luminosity slider or use the luminosity blend mode sorry it's not a slider it's a blend mode so click here and find luminosity and give that a click and that's going to help you so you can be a little more aggressive on your strength there so let's just move that up right around in there now let's come up to this eyeball right here so we can see the before and after just give that a click so there's the before a lot of haze there's the after haze is gone pretty magical pretty cool filter well, thanks again for joining me today on The Joy of Editing with Dave Kelly. If you like this one, please give it a like and share it with your friends. And also, if you're not yet a subscriber with this channel, please do so and click the bell notification icon so you can be informed of all the new videos that I'm putting out. Thanks again for joining me today on The Joy of Editing with Dave Kelly. Mwah. I'll see you guys next time. So long.